Hi there folks, well, welcome back to my channel and for this video I'm actually going to be showing you how, uh, one of the easiest plants to take a cutting from in order to propagate it and to grow a new plant from it. But I will get on to that in a moment, a bit of housekeeping first. If you're enjoying my channel, if you enjoy my videos, if you can click on the subscribe button and click on that notification bell, leave some likes, leave some comments, it's always really appreciated and it does help the channel to grow. So. The topic of this video uh, will be I will be showing you how to take a cutting from a mint plant, how to propagate it in order to get another plant. So I will be having to go outside to show you how to do this, and all you will really need will be a wee container of water and uh, some snips, like some secateurs. I do have these wee mini snips that I can use, that I use which make it a lot easier to cut uh, and do it delicately. So just have to be heading outside and taking the cutting for you and showing you what to do. So it's grown nice and well. Just trying to find a stem that I want to take. I think that I will go for this one. Oh, I'll let it go. There it is. So, just taking a snip of it. And what you do is that you remove. The lower leaves so you have a bare bit that you can just nestle into the water and what you do is that you leave it in a wee container, a wee jar container of water for about a week and you'll then you'll start to notice that there'll be little white roots coming off the bottom and once you've got enough fruitage on it you plant it up and you obviously make sure that you keep it nice and watered and it will start growing like they do business so obviously make sure that once it's uh, once it's in the jar just make sure that you keep the water level at a decent level and make sure it doesn't run dry so in about a week's time I'll be able to plant this up and I'll be able to have a new mint plant. Once you take your cutting inside, just leave it in a sunny spot. So in a nice sunny window ledge like this one here. And you don't have to put in any root growing powder or any anything like that. You just let it sit somewhere sunny, somewhere warm, with water a little root. So like once uh once it does start to root in about a week I probably will do a follow-up video about potting it up and getting it outside. So that was a quick wee video about propagating uh, a new mint plant and taking a wee cutting for it. So I'm just gonna as I was saying just there I will be leaving it on the sunny window ledge and checking it on it in about a week's time and it should have rooted by then. So hopefully you will have found that interesting and hopefully uh, it will be something that you might try yourself in your own garden or your own little space uh, where you keep the plants and it's probably quite a good way of uh, like grow growing some extra plants that you could possibly pass on to somebody else that if somebody else is thinking about doing a bit of gardening, uh, not knowing things like this that can help, maybe kind of give them a start. And you never know, like, doing a bit of a plant swapping might be a good idea, especially with how prices are going right now. And the, the whole idea of plant swapping or crop swapping, it's always a good idea. But I, d I don't know if I've maybe kind of mentioned this before in previous videos, but if you are growing mint, it is quite a voracious grower 
and if you plant it out into like a bit of your garden it will do its best to try and take over so I would suggest if you do have a mint plant or if you have more than one mint plant keep them in pots yeah just get, get them a nice big pot and just plant them in that and they'll grow away happy as Larry so but that's again how to propagate and grow the extra spare one uh, hopefully you will find that interesting and informative and I will see you all in the next video. Bye bye.